Hello again everyone and welcome to part 2 of my A1200 unboxing video. This time I'm going to turn it on and see what happens. Now I don't know whether people think this is a little bit reckless, I don't know. In my defence, um, this machine was never fitted with a battery backed clock. So I know there's, no, there's not a battery in there that's been leaking away for the last 20 years or so. Um, but I thought, do you know what, I'm just going to connect it up to the telly turn it on and see what happens. Uh, I've been fortunate enough to find um, an RGB connector from the monitor output that uses um, the correct connector with the right number of pins rather than one that's kind of been sawn down, so that's good. And I've checked the manual for the telly and it will accept, um, the other end's a SCART connector and it will accept an RGB SCART, not just a composite video one. So it should be good to go. Let's just see what happens. This is honestly the first time I've turned this on in, in sort of over 20 years. So fingers crossed. Oh, one other thing. I seem to remember when I was a student, I customised the startup sequence a little bit to something that I thought was pretty cool at the time, uh, but not maybe has stood the test of time all that well. Let's see what happens. Let's turn the volume up. All right, here we go. Well, <laughs> the lights are on. I can hear the hard disk. Let's drive the flop. Let's go. No way. Atomic batteries to power. Turbines to speed. Roger. Ready to move out. There they should be here. Oh. <laughs> what about that? I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Been so long. Mm, this isn't look quite. It's not quite synced up. Right, the video signal's not synced. Uh, and then what's down here? Sort of panning around. Okay. There we are. Right. System. What's in here? Wow, this <laughs> storage, utilities, files, dev, system, and game. Ooh, what's the game? Oh, wow, look at that. Pimble Fantasies. I've got Pimble Fantasies, Wing Commander, Syndicate, Missile Command, Island of Nefertan, and loads of other stuff. That's cool. Okay, well, I'm going to spend a little bit of time now, I think, going through this uh, little treasure trove. <laughs> and seeing what we have. But there you go. A 20 year old Amiga, well more than 20 year old, it's been in its box for 20 years, it's 27 years old. Powered it on first time, and I swear it's the first time I've powered it on, and it's come on straight away, run the startup sequence, and uh, it's just as if I was in 1997 again. So I hope you've enjoyed that, and I'll see you next time.